So in March, Ghana will be playing against Angola in African Cup of Nations qualifiers. And uh, it will be a very big game. And, uh, you know, Ghana has one win and one draw from two matches that they have played so far uh, in the qualifiers. Okay, you know, Ghana first beat Madagascar. 3-0 at the Cape Coast Sports Stadium, then traveled to Central African Republic and drew 1-1 with them. Then the next matches will be played in March, okay, to be double header. Ghana will play home. Ghana will play home first against Angola. Then uh, Black Stars will travel the next week to Angola to play against them. Okay, so you know, these are five players that are likely to miss uh, Otuados. That is Chris Hilton. Okay, first game, first match. As head coach, five players is likely that they will be missing out in action. They are very serious and also key players in the blaster. So I'll be sharing them with you uh, this very video. Don't forget that this is Bidu News TV. Subscribe to the channel. We hit the notification bell. We share this with your friends. Like and also you comment. So, you know, uh, five players of the Black Stars could miss Ghana's first game in 2020 after picking up injuries with their respective clubs. Okay, so they qualify for African Cup of Nations 2023 edition that will be playing in uh, uh, no, 2024 and it will be double header against Angola. Okay, so four players who were part of Ghana squad for the 2022 World Cup could be no miss out because of uh, injuries and other uh, stuff. Okay, so the matches will also be the first match for uh, Chris Hilton, who was recently appointed as head coach for the senior national team, the Blasters of Ghana. So now let's take a look at this uh, five uh, players. Okay, so now one is uh, Ali Sedu. Okay, so the defender got injured in Clement Ford's game against Lily in the French League. Okay, after going under, you know, go do a surgery. Okay, he did a surgery, and the 22 year old is expected to recover in four weeks' time. Okay, so a month time that he will be coming out and uh, he will not be ready for competitive match when he uh, recovered because you'll be doing recovery sessions and playing some small, small match, but he will not be ready for Ghana's game against Angola, okay, in March. It's not possible for him to come and play in that very game. So Ali Dusedu is number one who went to the World Cup that he'll be missing this very match, okay. So number two is, that's Elisha. Also, okay, no, Lasha also is an Angels player and got injured in training and had to be carried off the pitch by his teammate. Uh, his teammates know that they carry her from the pitch because of the injury. You know, after careful examination, doctors find out that the player had a tear. Okay, so the midfielder who played for the Black Stars at the World Cup tournament has unfortunately been ruled out of the season and would miss Ghana's match against Angola. So he, will, he, he had been ruled out for the rest of the season okay so we'll not be playing for angus for the whole you know remainder of the season you know he signed for angus just uh past general that he signed for them and he has probably one match in this thing has happened to him is unfortunate okay so another player that could miss is daniel kofi chure okay so the 26 year old suffer a rupture ligament and will be uh unable to play for the rest of the season and he sustained the injury during training session resulting in a tear in his uh rocket ligament okay so charlie all these players are getting injured during training session because they want to impress, they want to play, they want to do everything possible to get playing time. So they got that injured though, injury. So he also has been ruled out for the rest of the season. He will not be playing for his team feedback you know, for the rest of the season. And the team also announced this serious you know, injury and it has ruled him uh, for the rest of the season. He will not be playing. So uh, I say seasonal a bit and is very very serious and unfortunate okay so another player that could miss here is uh, thomas the party you know, the arsenal star got injured ahead of their crucial game against manchester city in the premier league where they lost by three goals to one you know party trained with his teammate on tuesday but had to be you no know, sideline in their match on wednesday against man city it is feared that the player had a muscular problem and needs to uh no take some rest and recover fully okay it is unknown if the midfielder could be available for ghana's game against angola in march or not okay so it will depend on the uh, asna uh, doctors to determine that situation if uh, an opportunity will be available or will not be available for those 
game so okay so another player that will uh miss the game is a possible is uh joseph pinto okay so just i know most people will laugh at joseph pinto because you know he has not been with the blasters uh, despite his uh form in a league side but hey let's see what will happen chris will determine whether he'll be part or not okay so blasters ring has suffered a shoulder injury in uh, krc gained match no to the, 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 the defeat to uh, Antioch, where Antioch, okay, the 25-year-old left the pitch in pain after effort to gain him back on the pitch proven filter, okay, so the Joseph Painter was expected to go, uh, you know, do uh, some scan and see the extent of the injury. The player who misses the World Cup could be a major doubt for Ghana's game against Angola. So, let's see how it will end for him after the scan is being done okay so joseph pinto uh could miss blasters game against angola even though it's not go to world cup okay and also thomas Tepate, uh there's still some doubts to see if uh, party will be able to play or not then uh, also another one here is a uh, very one daniel kofichu kofichu also has been ruled out for the rest of the season he will not be playing for his team fell back and he will not be playing for the blasters of ghana because of that injury that he has been ruled out okay then another one is elisha also very ball playing midfielder he, he is good whenever he holds the ball he is good in distributing the ball he is very very good he signed for you know his new club uh aj angus this january and he got injured and he also have been ruled out for the rest of the season and he will not be playing in Ghana's game against Angola. Okay, so he also is off. Then another last, uh, the first one that I spoke about is Alidu Sedu. Now you said you played two matches in the World Cup for Ghana. Okay, and uh, that is it. He also had got injured, but he will cover in four weeks time as a month time, but he will not be ready for Ghana's game, you know, because well, after recovery, he has to do some recovery training, some sessions, light training before he will start playing football. So he will not be available in Ghana's game against Angola. So guys, this is it. Uh, this is Brady News TV and these are the five players likely to miss Chris Hilton's first game as Blasters head coach. Don't forget that you subscribe to the channel with the notification bell, share this video to your friends, like and also your comment. As I always say, let's continue to pray for Christian Achu Chasam, and I will bring you all the updates as soon as it falls on ground. This is Bird News TV. Let's meet another time. Bye bye for now. Bye.